25 miles north of Fort Collins lay the Waverly community, nestled next to the mountains and away from the hustle and bustle of Fort Collins city life. Within the Waverly community lays the CSU-owned Gabbard Rutledge property. The 313-acre plot has limitless potential to serve as a living laboratory for students of the Warner College of Natural Resources. CSU purchased the west half of the property in 1963, followed by the purchase of the eastern half in 1970. During the 50s and 60s, the property was widely seeded with non-native forage grasses, which still dominate the property today. In the last year, however, seeding with native plant species has begun. Unfortunately, the property has not been utilized to its full potential and has instead served as a storage site for various professors from the university. We sat down with Dr. Paul Myman to talk about various research have, projects. Um, a couple of grad students who are doing their research projects out here. We have a, actually maybe three projects out here now. Um, one set of plots right over here, we're looking at different seed mixes of native annuals and how they compete with cheatgrass. Um, we have another student out here, Mark, another one of Mark's students, working on milk vetch, a native ford that we find out here. Um, and then we've got, a, I think, a postdoc is starting another cheatgrass study over on the old railroad. In the last few years, Dr. Paul Myman and Dr. Mark Paschke have begun work to clean up with promising outcomes. Cassie Kiefer is a grad student currently working on the property. The whole convenience factor of just having everything in one place would, um, I think, encourage people to maybe use that property, to use that facility, and I think a lot can be learned out on that property in terms of ecosystem interactions and plants and animals and invasive plants. <laughs> would be a, uh, a great target <laughs> out there, but you know, having, having a facility right on the property would really... With the aid of your donations, other projects will be able to come to life. Donations will also aid in the construction of much-needed structures on the property, including a fully functional lab. The Gabbard Rutledge Project is an essential resource to students of the Warner College of Natural Resources. The property offers the hands-on experiential learning needed to survive in our field today. Uh, um, the do donations could help immensely. I mean, right now we, we've got these two metal buildings. Uh, both of them are in, in good shape and, you know, it's great for storing some of the equipment in here and doing work in under a roof when it's raining or snowing or, or something like that. But as it stands right now, we really don't have any anything close to a lab facility or a classroom facility. If we, you know, have a class out here and we need to just go sit down and go through something between uh, being outside and doing some sampling and hands-on stuff.